Roy, can I get a latte, please? Certainly. You just gotta forget about Steve. It's just biology. I thought we're gonna be a family. There's no greater commitment than that. The other quarter, I'd like it split between my three grandchildren. Simon, Amy and yourself. Yeah, I feel better for that. Good to have got it done. Oh, I wish you'd give me... Let me woman. I know exactly what's come up. Eh? What? Never you mind. You can't just hint at something juicy and then leave me hanging. So you've not come down yet? No, I'm a gog. She said... No, that... um, she's gone out. Where? Shopping. Oh, what's she playing at? She knows I'm booked in at the spa. I know, it's some emergency birthday present or something. Anyway, come on, chop, chop. Relax, eh, booze. See ya. Bye, babe. Yeah, for you do it. Just watch yourself. Hi. Oh, I've got something. Brian is a fool. He has far too much to say for himself. I think he's just trying to be jovial, but comes out all wrong. I'll say. He must have been able to see he'd upset you making fun of your things. <sighs> it's sad to think there's not a trace of me left at Roy's flat. We should have built a bonfire, burnt everything our exes ever left us. I thought the rest of my life was mapped out. Still, no point in picking over the bones of it. I should be looking to the future. I've got an appointment at Audrey's this afternoon. I think you should go instead. My treat. Are you saying my hair's a mess? I, I think you need cheering up. A bit of pampering will put a spring in your step. <laughs> Who do you think you are, you?